First Lady. Um, can you please tell us uh, why you graced us with your presence at the Summit Against Gender Based Violence and Femicide? So I'm the president of the organization of African First Ladies and we felt it's very important to come and support this uh, presidential summit because it's such an example for the region of the kind of political leadership and commitment that is needed to eliminate gender-based violence because it needs to be done by every single voice but it has to start right at the top. And uh, First Lady, you are a feminist in your own right. Um, if you could look at Namibia, would you say it's a safer place for women and children to live? I don't think anywhere in the world is safe for women and children too. Um, Namibia is no exception. There definitely are pockets um, of places where it's not safe. I mean, in our own homes, in churches, in schools, in the workplace, um, women are not safe across the world. And I think if we get it right in Namibia, we get it right in South Africa, in Nigeria. We need to get it right everywhere so that women everywhere can be safe. And where do you think South Africa needs to focus in order for us to win this fight? Again? It's a multi-sectoral fight, uh, but certainly a little bit more work needs to go on prevention. A changing problematic mindsets, which often takes the longest time, and um, also reforming the criminal justice system, where there must be accountability. Where there's no accountability, there's impunity. And where there's impunity, people do things knowing that they'll get away with it.